Hey guys, today we are going to look at a video. This is from my local store. I haven't been there recently, but I do have a video on my channel where they were kind enough to show me a collection they had just got in, which included Power 9, lots of Alpha and Beta, and hindsight at that time, which was a year or two ago, I should have purchased the entire collection, but hindsight is always 2020. So recently they were robbed, and this is the video. It looks like a couple of people, it looks like a couple, and they go in the store, do some Christmas shopping, they have a trash bag. I mean, it's very clear, they break the door down, this is what they took. They took a lot of Warhammer. They took Magic the Gathering Kaladesh gift boxes because that's obviously the most valuable thing you can take. Uh, Ultra Pro Satin Towers, one of each color. A 175 count blue deck box. And lots and lots of candy as well as the laptop. And as they left, they broke the door. And as they left, they had a trail of candy follow them out to the parking lot. Which is both very sad and yet somewhat funny. But mo mostly sad. So the store, which I will have a link to the description in the description below, is having a 10% off sale to try to pay money to, you know, fix the door that was broken in. It's a great local store. Um, I contacted them via Facebook. Then they scheduled a visit with me where I they allowed me to film. And I was able to film like a huge, huge vintage collection. And I really appreciate that because they made it simple. The owner came in to greet me and he knew what I was there to do. And he bought in the boxes and he even gave me a very good deal. Some of the older cards, the older bulk, which I still have that collection today. So if you can support this store or leave, you know, a helpful comment or if you know these two people who are robbing, it's actually very high quality video. If you know these two people who are robbing the store, yeah, just contact them. I have a phone number in the previous slide. It's just very sad to see this happen. And it's even more sad to see it happen to a store who I know the owner loves the store and is not doing it for money. I was able to talk to owner for an hour or two hours, maybe even longer when I was filming my... Um, the vintage collection video anyway i will have a link to the store at the very least just hey if you can say hey keep keep your head up happy holidays or leave them a comment i know that they would appreciate it because it is tough it is tough having a store especially in the area i live in this is not i guess that uncommon but it is sad to see bye guys